Hi everybody, Nick Asadlov here from IBM and OpenNTF. In IBM connections, community moderators often want to extend their communities, for example by adding custom widgets. However, typically the community moderators are not the administrators who have the rights to deploy new widgets. In order to allow moderators to add their own widgets anyway, I've created another generic iWidget called the XPages iWidget. This widget only has to be deployed once. After this, moderators can add one or multiple instances of it to their communities, allowing them to integrate custom XPages applications very easily into their communities. Here's a quick demonstration. So I start a new community, give it a name, demo XPages, and save it. After that, as a community moderator, I can customize it. So here I see all the out-of-the-box widgets, as well as the HTML widget and the new XPages widget. I can click on this XPages widget to add an instance of it to the community. When I scroll down, I see now this empty um, widget showing up right here. As a community moderator, I see also this link which brings me into edit mode. And obviously that link can only be used and is only seen by community moderators and not by usual members or readers of that community. So here I can define a title for the widget as well as URLs pointing to the view mode and the full page mode of that widget. And here I need to define a unique ID which I will talk about in a minute. Then I can save it refresh the page and now I actually see my X page I widget showing up right here. Also when I change the, um, the size of the window the size of the widget is changed um, automatically. And I can open the same widget also in full page mode by clicking here on the link um, that shows up automatically in the navigator in the left column. Now, since this is an X page, I can also easily access connections using the connections REST APIs and an infrastructure that we call X pages social enabler that makes invoking REST APIs very easy. So I'm currently logged in as Frank Adams, who doesn't have any bookmarks yet. Um, however, when I go back to my community, to my X page, I can click on these icons here and then when I go back to bookmarks and do a refresh, I can see that the same URL, the same bookmark shows up now here under my bookmarks. So that's one simple example for how to embed an X page into a community without having to deploy another iWidget. And as I mentioned earlier, I can also add a second instance of that same widget. So let me do this, I click on X page, X pages widget again and I scroll down here it is I need to go into edit mode need to get another URL and this is just another very easy um, X page but it's a different one and again I need to define here unique key in this case it's lorem and I save it and I can refresh the page so that the second widget shows up and again, the resizing works and it works independently for both of the X pages widgets. Now, for developers, I just wanted to quickly describe and explain what they have to do in order to embed their own X pages and what this one setting is used for. So, let me go to um, Designer. Here it is. Now developers have to embed one custom control that is called generic X pages I widget. And in here they define two parameters. One is whether it's full page mode or view mode. And the other one is that same unique ID that I just defined in the edit mode of the widget. So that's a quick demonstration of the X pages I widget. I hope you enjoyed it. Bye bye.